Oh. Oh. Oh, God. Hello, guys. Welcome back to yet again another video now. It's been quite a while since I've done a sit down, speak to the camera video. Um, but yeah, in today's video, we're going to point out something I did very stupid last season. Um, because it's funny and I feel like an idiot for it. Anyway, um, obviously last season I made a prediction video called EFL Championship Predictions, okay? 17-18 um, season competition and giveaway. Uh, yes, I did a giveaway for it. Make sure you watch till the end of this video because I've got a little announcement about that. What did I do in that video which was stupid, Alex? Um, now, if you haven't seen the video, this is what I did. It's probably the worst thing I've ever predicted. But yeah, watch this. Top of the league, this is the big one now, Sunderland, okay? Sunderland, I do think they're going to win the league because they are a Premier League team. I could be totally wrong here and they might not even get top six. But yeah, I've put Sunderland top of the league because the top of the league, I've put Sunderland, I've got some good players, okay? There you go. <laughs> so, <laughs> Sunderland to come top. What was I thinking? Uh, yeah. Um, so yeah, basically I made that one, there's this one prediction which you've obviously now seen, um, which I'm going to be speaking about in this video because the amount of stick and abuse I've got for that is just, <laughs> it's just beyond me. Um, it's, it's, it's really funny. Looking back at the prediction, it's quite funny um, because they're now in League One. Um, <laughs> and <sighs> it was just such an awful prediction, weren't it, really? Um, obviously, the reason why I predicted them to come top was... Before last season, they were in the Premier League. Um, but yes, they did get relegated fairly, fairly uh, comfortably. They got relegated fairly easily. Um, the, re yeah, the reason why I predicted them to come top was because <sighs> the past few seasons before last year, they'd been sustaining their Premier League status fairly well. They've been like surviving in the Premier League by the clinch of their teeth. So I thought if they were to get relegated, they'd probably probably go back up because of the team they have but they did lose quite a few players um, and they have had like so many managers in the past year or two <laughs> I'm pretty sure they've kept changing managers so that doesn't really help but yeah um, I predicted them to come top and they obviously came 24 so complete opposite okay so I predict it's just that is awful honestly um, honestly the worst prediction I've ever made <laughs> The worst I thought they would have done is probably mid-table, but I genuinely thought they were going to really go for it and try and get back in the Premier League, but yeah, we won't talk about it anymore. It's embarrassing, honestly embarrassing, because I did get a lot of abuse to stick for it. Um, it's funny though, um, but yeah, we're going to read through some of the comments. <laughs> this is only going to be a short video, it's just, yeah, I want to get my head across this because all these comments are just, I find them funny, um, and yeah, I just want to do a little reflection on... <laughs> why I predicted them top and why it's just like the worst prediction isn't it really anyway we'll read through some of the comments and yeah yeah this is this comment isn't related to Sunderland but the most liked comment is from Martin Dunn he's a Nottingham Forest fan I believe because his logo uh, he predicted no one can predict the championship I totally agree it just does go to show doesn't it that no one can predict the championship um, but yeah, that got 78 likes, and that's quite crazy. I, I do agree with you. It's very hard to predict this championship. I wouldn't say no one can predict it, because I did make a few good predictions. But yeah, it's very, very hard to predict. The, it is very hard to predict the championship. Anyway, let's move on. Sunderland first, with loads of laughing emojis. Now, that got 49 likes. That's embarrassing, honestly. <laughs> um, I've been mugged off by 49 people. No, anyway, move on, move on. Um, the next next comment is Sunderland first. Ha 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 ha. They got turned down by a Scottish nobody and Steve McLaren. Middlesbrough will easily come top two. Um, right, yeah, I, <laughs> so, yeah, I predicted Sunderland top. I know, I know. But yeah, Middlesbrough will easily come top two. Where do they come? Someone put Sunderland first. Are you ill? Borough are gonna smash the league. Um, I probably was ill when I predicted the Sunderland to come top, to be honest. Um, and Barra going to smash the league. They didn't smash the league, mate. Um, but they did get playoffs, so fair play. Anyway, the next next comment is... Um, um, yeah, next next comment I want to point out... <laughs> sorry, I feel really bad for like roasting your comments, but... Aston Villa. 
to win the playoffs. <laughs> Someone put another another comment saying, "You were totally wrong with Sunderland." I didn't know. I did just didn't know. No, sorry. Um, no, I. <laughs> Honest, obviously, I appreciate all the comments I get on my videos, but yeah, um, it, it's quite funny seeing all them comments. But obviously, I know it's the worst prediction I've ever done, and yeah, it's all I wanted to say in this video. It's funny looking through your comments, guys. Um, but yeah, that's all I'm going to look through for now. Another comment saying Sunderland first with loads of laughing emojis, um, which is this one by Tom22. Couldn't have been more wrong, lol. Now, there we go, there's some of the comments, there are obviously a lot more comments because I've got like 400 comments on there. <laughs> but yeah, it was just a bad prediction now. That's all I wanted to do, I just wanted to read through some of the comments, I wanted to point out why I predicted them top and yeah, it's just kind of funny looking back on the video to be honest. Um, anyway, that is the end of this video, if you did enjoy it, leave it a like, it was a bit of a different one, um, but yeah. Before I do end this video, I've got to make a quick announcement, alright? Now, on my video I made, that EFL prediction video I made last year, which, which we've been looking at in this video, um, I obviously did a giveaway, um, and the giveaway was £25. It was a £25 gift card, um, and I said the winner would be whoever gets the most accurate prediction, okay? Um, and obviously I've got like 300 entries, so... <sighs> Um, if you're wondering where, if you're wondering when I'm going to announce the giveaway winner, it's probably going to be in a couple of weeks' time because I've still got to go through all the comments. I've got to work out who made the best prediction, um, and yeah, I will be giving your comment a heart. I will be commenting on your comment, and yeah, I will be getting in touch with you because obviously this giveaway is still happening, so don't worry about that. Um, but yeah, so it'll take a bit of time to work out who won. Anyway. Next year's prediction video will be out a bit later than the one I did last year because obviously last year I did upload very early and there were a lot of transfers happening during the process as well. So I'm going to try and wait for some of the transfers to happen before I make any predictions for next season. Um, and yeah, hopefully it's more accurate because last season was absolutely dreadful. But it's quite funny. Anyway, thanks for watching this video once again. Make sure you do leave this video a like because... You do. You guys are smashing the support at the moment. It does mean a lot to me. Um, and yeah, I'll see you guys in the next video. Subscribe if you are new, and I'll yeah, see you in the next one.